I haven't done an unboxing video in quite some time, so I thought I would do an unboxing of lot 341 from Parks Auction. I picked this up yesterday, and I bought all these goodies for $1. Yes, $1. And the reason I bid on this box is I wanted the banana tree. So let's see what all is in this box. First, it looks like there's a Coke, and I haven't had time to look at it. I think it's a reproduction of the old Coke bottles with the engraving on them, and it looks like it says Atlanta on the bottom, USA. I don't see a year. Anyway, that's kind of a cute conversation piece. Next is a container of, or a package of, bendy straws. And we really like those when we have smoothies, and we're out of flexible drinking straws. So that's a win. And here is a straw container that we don't have one of these, so it's kind of cool. I don't know how I feel about straws that are in there that aren't in a package, so those may have to go, but now we have a straw container. And the item that I really wanted, because I've never had one, is a banana tree. And I think the banana tree is well worth a dollar, don't you? I didn't break anything. Next is a napkin holder, and the napkin holder looks like it also has a place for toothpicks and salt and pepper and various things. So here's the salt, here's the pepper, and here is a second salt and pepper. I don't really know what this is. Uh, I have no clue. It looks like you could put paper towels on the top, yet then it still has these uh, acrylic dishes to hold things, uh, compartments to hold things. Oh, Heinz. Looks like it might be from a restaurant. You put your condiments in that. Goodness knows I love condiments, especially mustard and ketchup. So that's another Another fun that we have there. I do not, not know what these are. Let's see. Could these be ashtrays? I don't know. There are two of these. So, pardon the clanking noises. And I think this must be a mug tree. Uh, you might leave it in the comments if you think it's something else. It's a mug tree or something like that. It's kind of industrial looking. I'm getting a whole kitchen island full of things. And here's a nice trivet to put something hot on so it doesn't burn your countertop. Small basket with handles that fold. Looks like it might need some cleaning or it might need to go into recycle. And then a large basket. Looks like maybe some oil or vinegar has been sp spilled in that. Maybe that can be cleaned up. The other thing that's not in here is an early American press cut uh, decanter for oil or vinegar. I've got that already soaking in the sink. So, for the big price of a dollar, I got all of these goodies. Leave me a comment and let, you know, let me know if you think I did all right. And happy auctioning.